what you see here is another DisplayPort use case uh, of DisplayPort 1.2 use case, which is showing a multi-streaming capabilities. So what we are showing here is uh, uh, there are two displays uh, stage here, which streaming the content from the notebook, and uh, one more display uh, streaming the content from iPad. The concept here is today you have a um, your work environment set up with multiple displays. You come there, dock your uh, notebooks, and the video, audio content, you can see it over the uh, monitors. So, but you use a, a bulky dock station, uh, which of course are very dependent on the type of computers, type of the models you use. Uh, the concept of what we're showing here is a use case of a universal docking station, which instead of using a conventional dock connector, uses a simple uh, single cable, allows you to connect to the DisplayPort connector on this side, of course, um, of your computer, and which also allows you to kind of uh, dock uh, your handheld devices such as iPad, iPhone, in the future, any type of USB-based uh, uh, handheld devices, allow you, you to stream uh, for the user to select any content on the desktops, uh, monitors you configure in your uh, work environment. Um, so what we are also showing is uh, a conversion from DisplayPort into a legacy type of interfaces so that you can use VGA monitors or HDMI monitors, DVI monitors. So this will be sort of a universal dock station which works independently of the type of uh, computers, the models, etc. So uh, one of the additional benefits of DisplayPort is which allows you to transfer the USB content uh, directly on the same cable at the same time allows you to charge uh, your computer. So this we see is one of the very useful use cases uh, for an enterprise applications which uh, of course uh, uh, reduces space, uh, reduces power and allows a lot of flexibility in terms of sharing the content between your mobile devices as well as on the computer.